Mr. Speaker. The reality is they didn't take it seriously in 2015. They didn't get the job done with Obama in 2016, and they're mailing it in right now in 2017. And now we're seeing thousands and thousands of jobs right across, uh, right across Canada being lost. The government's aid package for softwood industry is too little, too late for the forestry workers and their families. Mills are already closing down across the country, and this money won't bring those jobs back. Canadian forestry workers deserve stability and predictability from their government. What does the Minister of Natural Resources have to say to those workers that want jobs, not EI? Well, the Minister of Natural Resources. Mr. Speaker, uh, I, I appreciate the question, and I share the honourable member's concern about workers who might be laid off, which is why we are investing uh, 90 million new dollars in helping the transition and in the reskilling of those peoples, at the same time that we're making $605 million available in loan guarantees, and in the long term, more investments in the marketplace, in transition, in the expansion of export markets for the workers. We understand the importance of this industry, and we will protect the workers, the community. The honourable member for Prince.